yeah now um because right today i am free so it's good i can talk to you also now um somebody wanted to raise some voice you want to leave means you can go no problem sina was ready garu mere maatladaru kada sir and you wanted to tell something no sir uh, sir i have to leave uh, no problem I'll join tomorrow yeah puneet puneet i just wanted to tell you i don't yes, know um, whether i gave you that uh, ibps rrbp wo folder i have given you uh i think sir you have shared yesterday i have given it na right in that folder this is what is there one minute hold on i'll show you this yeah this is the one i am telling you in this uh, mr punita um, uh, so i i have given uh yesterday i had had some questions yes yes i i, I saw that sir <laughs> some 60 pages yes i i, I saw that booklet hmm because This i copied it i copied it from some place and posted it here and it will be very okay. interesting yesterday we started discussing that also okay yesterday we were discussing that uh one minute what what is that page anybody can tell me it's on the first or second page it's a thing yesterday banking and economic then or ah 2024 ibps rrbpo this is the one these things are all very interesting baba i collected from some website almost all these pages whatever it contains is very interesting we will read them now we will read them now and after that is over uh, you are having questions i have given that in tamil then some more questions are given in uh, new questions please prepare for these questions uh, puneet yes sir yes sir for you these are I... the relevant questions yeah i i yes sir so scale to also sir yes sir scale to also this will be relevant scale to i think i have given you the link you can go through this yeah yeah yes sir but uh, there was some problem in accessing that Uh, so I will I will manage. I will try to check if there is any error. Uh, you you, you, you can download through good internet connection and uh, uh, yeah. take it into your laptop. If you are not able to download, please go to the nearby mm -hmm. browsing center, get it download, and store it in your pen drive and use it in your laptop. Uh, I tried from um, mobile. I will try from laptop also. Mo mobile uh, say nahi aaye. Mobile say nahi aayega. Yeah. Okay, okay, yeah. Now yes, we yes. will go through this material. I don't know whether you people might have studied it. My, you might not have had time to go through this. So now we will read this. Um, who will volunteer to read? First, we will start with the. Uh, Sunita Osur, Sunita Osur, please read. Uh, can I leave, sir? Yeah, you can leave. No problem. Please go. Thank you. I will post yes, the video. Yes, Thank you. I will post you so the much, video. Sir. Thank you. Bye yes. bye. Yes, yes, sir. Thank you. Thank you so much. Bye bye. Thank you. Bye. Now, Sunita, please read. Yes. Points to note. the united states of america china japan germany and india are the largest economies in the world in 2023 as per their gdp data gdp serves as a key metric for assessing the magnitude of nation's economy the conventional approach for um, approach gauging. for causing a country's causing 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 means measuring cause measuring is causing a country's gdp involves the expenditure method wherein total total is derived by aggreg aggregating expenditure on fresh consumer goods new investments consumer government outlays and 
the net value of exports second india yeah. is ranked fifth in the world's gdp ranking in 2023 india's economy boosts diversity and swift growth fueled by key sectors such as information technology service uh, agriculture and manufacturing the nation capitalizes on its broad domestic market a youthful and technologically adept labor force and an expanding middle class very good next pangudi no no i will ask panugutti emerson to read third no question please read the third how point is, how is grown uh, grass domestic, uh, domestic product computed gdp is determined by summing up consumption expenditure by consumers government expenditure invest expenditure by business and net, net exports the difference between the exports and imports so fourth please one. read it again india please has read it again please read again three number three how is grown gross domestic product computed gdp is determined by summing of consumption expenditure by consumers government expenditure investment expenditure by businesses and net ex net, net exports the difference between the exports and imports okay india continue. has witnessed india has witnessed 7.2 percent growth in gross domestic domestic product which is higher compared to other major economics such as us china indonesia and the uk among others as per data as per data released by the government on its twitter handle at the rate my my gov india comma indonesia has observed a 5 percent growth second to india and japan stand, uh, stands at the lowest with a 1.1 percent increase in 2023 one minute let uh, no, listen listen let me caution you this is as for 2023 if only you come across some other latest data you please post it in our group so that others can also get to change it okay yes. now please go to question number sorry point number five msme schemes growth in coal mining rise in cashless payments and upi surge in elect electricity consumption a considerable growth in freight loading for railways boom in startups and industry entrepreneurship and all time high in india's exports are some of the reasons that the government has outlined behind the spurt in the gdp rate spurt means what increase increase sir. spurt increase. spurt means yes, increase. increase very good one minute next also you read yeah please read india's gdp has reached dollar 3.75 trillion in 2023 from around dollar 2 trillion in 2014 Moving from 10th largest to 5th largest economy in the world, India is now being called a bright spot in the global economy. Yeah. Seventh? Yeah, 2023 has been a tumultuous year by standards, replete with wars, political turbulence. Yeah, one minute, one minute. Uh, this, I'm just rearranging it. Yeah. Now read from seven. Year two thousand twenty-three. In the cumulus year by the standards, replete with the wars, political turbulence, price and interest interest rate surges, extraordinary volatility in the financial markets, and apocalyptic visions of economic economists biting the dust. It has also been a year of remarkable resilience. Rainful financial markets and of many economies around, uh, around the world defining defining the inexorability of recession and the financial distress. Yeah, actually, what is the meaning of um, resilience? Resilience means and strong, not sir, giving strong. up, not giving up, trying again and again. Okay, very good. Jitin Prasad, Jitin Prasad, yes, one minute. Yes. I will just alter, alter it. Mm -hmm. One minute. Just a minute. Just a minute. Yeah, okay, I will alter this so that it can come correctly. Mm 
Yeah. Please read this CBDC. Yeah, CBDC, Central Bank Digital Currency is a digital form of currency notes issued by a, issued by a AR RBI. R no, no, um, no, no. Yeah. by yeah, RBI, yeah. it is wrong. Yeah, yeah. By RBI, by yeah, RBI. Wrong. Continue. Yeah, while most central banks across globe are exploring the issuance of CBDC, the key motivations for its issuance are specific to each, but, yeah, each country's unique requirements. It is referred to as, yeah, it is referred to as E, a digital rupee. The digital rupee will provide additional option to the current, currently available forms of money. It is sustainably not different from banknotes, but being digital, it is likely to be easier, faster, and cheaper. It also has all the transactional benefits of other forms of digital money. Visa Bank's approach is governed by two basic uh, considerations. To create a digital rupee that is a close that is as close as possible to a paper currency and to manage the process of introducing digital rupee in a seamless manner key motivators yeah so cbdc being a sovereign currency holds unique advantages of central bank yeah central bank money via press safety liquidity settlement finality and integrity the key motivations for exploring the issuance of CBDC in India, among other, include reduction in operational costs involved in physical cash management, fostering financial inclusion, bringing resilience, efficiency, and innovation in payments, pay, payment system, adding efficiency to the settlement system, boosting innovation in cross-border payment space, and providing public with, the, with use that any private virtual currency can. Can provide. Yeah, can provide without the associated risk. The use of. The, yeah, so, um, the, one minute. I'll adjust it. Yeah. Otherwise, it is yeah. causing confusion. Yeah. Yeah, with this we will go after this. It is a responsibility. Yeah, it is okay, a responsibility. We, did we stop yeah. here or is this correct? It is a responsibility. It is a responsibility of central bank to provide its citizens with a risk-free central bank digital money, which will provide the users the same experience of dealing in currency in digital form without any risk associated with private cryptocurrency. Therefore, CBDC will provide the public with benefits of virtual, virtual currencies while ensuring uh, virtual currencies while ensuring consumer protection by avoiding the the, the damaging right the damaging social no, and no, economic no. by avoiding the avoiding damage by avoiding the the aega. yeah. Yeah, avoiding the, the damaging damage. social okay. and economic social. consequences of oh, private, private virtual currencies. Virtual currencies. Very good. Com complete. Com complete this one. Yeah, CBD complete. Yeah. C mm -hmm. Oh, okay. CBDC is aimed to complement rather than replace current forms of money and is envisaged yeah, uh, to, to provide an additional payment avenue to users not to replace the existing payment system. Supported by state of art payment systems of India that are affordable, accessible, convenient, efficient, safe, and secure. The digital rupee system will further bolster India's digital economy. Make the money make, make the monetary and payment systems more efficient and contribute to furthering financial inclusion. Management of currency is one of the core central banking functions of for the, the Reserve Bank, Bank. For, which, yeah, for which it this, it derives the necessary statutory power from Section 22 of RBI Act 1934, along with the Government of India, 
the reserve bank is responsible for the design production and overall management of the nation's currency with the goal of ensuring an adequate supply of clean and genuine notes in the economy i think this much will do today for questions now for information we will go for one or two questions here then try to see how we are answering these questions yeah first question will be introduce or describe yourself i think we started that already and some of you were able to tell otherwise i suggest you go to your house and um, sit down and calmly think about yourself that is what is the name of your native place what is the place where you studied post graduation what is the place where you studied graduation mark scored by you then plus 2 if you have scored above 70 you can mention the marks and after telling that you can tell about any prizes awards received by you during plus 2 or college days and after that is over um you can tell about what are your strengths normally i tell candidates to tell that say i am a quick learner i am a hard working person i enjoy shouldering higher responsibilities responsibilities i am very good in planning and hence good in time management i possess leadership styles i also i am also a good team player i am good in problem solving like that you should tell it is not necessary i am good in communication you should tell every you not need not tell everything but when you tell about three or four items out of this you be ready to support that with your examples with your successes then your hobbies your likes and in the case of private sector banks when you go you have to highlight your skill about marketing but you can tell that even in rrb also you can say i enjoy communicating to people i want to be of service to people you can tell next question what is your father and mother doing tell about your family bharat can you read this bharat can you read yes, yes sir uh second point what is uh, what your father mother do tell me about your family third what you were doing during covid lockdown fourth what are your hobbies and interests mm -hmm. so for this uh, you, for this you try to prepare something like say gardening then uh, music then uh, say social service like that something concrete reading watching movies like that and you must be able and if you tell cricket hockey etc they will ask questions related to that currently happening in newspapers now we go to fifth question what is it yes fifth question uh if you will not get success uh, this time then you will then uh, what will you do your plan b Uh, you can tell them if i do not if, you, if i do not get success in this i will try for ibps po and also sbi po and ne if necessary i will try next year also once again yeah continue about your educational background why this graduation yeah Yes, well, this is uh, previously they were asking this question for all engineering graduates, but now you find more of engineers than other subjects. But still, they will ask you after studying mechanical engineering, why are you coming here? You have to tell them that in mechanical engineering that there are not sufficient job opportunities available, and banking is a field which is growing and it is offering good scope for career growth. that is why i want to come to banking okay continue 
seven. About your previous few minutes. Yes, please. Any doubt? Any doubt? Yes, sir. I am. Uh, I finish uh, plastic technology, sir, in engineering. Uh, it is a uh, unique subject, sir. What should I answer for this question, sir? See, um, I why they will ask you why did you choose plastic technology? You wanted to say I selected something which is not very common among others. Everybody was taking mechanical engineering, so I took up this. I thought there will be good op opportunities in this. After completing the degree, I find that there are not sufficient job opportunities. Now you can have a question like this. In plastic technology, who are your prospective employers? Unga line la, who are the people who are who can take you? Hello. Oh, yes, sir. In your line, plastic technology yes, line, what are the big companies? Tell us. See, if you tell answer, I don't know. They will form very low opinion about you. After okay. studying a degree for four long years, you are not aware what are the names of companies available in that line. Please ask your professors, lecturers. Okay. Search in Google. Okay. okay. So now what okay, was your sir. question? What was your question? After studying that, why you are coming here? Because you don't know what is the employer who is available. There are no companies. So if you tell that there are no sufficient job opportunities, they will ask who are the prospective employers. And if you say, I don't know, they will give you very low marks. Okay, sir. Understand? Yeah. Please prepare. Yes, now, where are okay, we now? Sir. Which question we were reading? Number seven. Sir, yeah. About your previous achievements, extracurriculum activities. Mm. What is Here the also, job profile? Mm -mm, of a bank PO. This I think we have discussed. Yeah, next. Why should we select you? At yeah, this point also I have told you many times. Why should we select you is that you, you can tell I possess the necessary qualification required for this post, number one. Number two, I am good in communication. I am interested in talking to people, convincing others. And I enjoy being of service to people. And that is why I would like to be selected in this bank. Okay, continue. Oh. Yes. What do you know about banking? What is a bank? Do you use banking services? Of course, everybody must be using banking services because all of you have bank accounts. You please get to know the name of the chairman of your bank. And where is the headquarters of your bank? Then what is a bank? Bank is a financial institution that accepts deposits from the public and making advances. Nowadays, banks are doing other para-banking activities also, such as bank assurance policies canvassing, then mutual fund products selling, and also wealth management advisory services. Bank assurance means banks will be entering into arrangement with insurance companies and they will sell their insurance policies, general as well as life insurance. For doing that, they will get commission. Similarly, mutual fund products means they will enter into arrangement with mutual fund companies and from the mutual fund companies, they will get commission. Do you get the point? So this is what it is. 
wealth management advisory means some rich individuals they will give that huge funds like 50 lakhs under 1 1 crore to the bank and ask them to invest in profitable enterprises they will set their rules observing that bank will invest money and try to improve their estate growing up like anything so that is about bank what do you know about banking banking uh, definition you tell banks give advances to banks have say safe savings bank current account fixed deposit and recurring deposit accounts Besides that, banks give advances for agriculture against gold, for education loan, for housing loan, for MSME loan. Banks also issue debit card and credit card. Banks provide ATMs for people to withdraw money. Banks also arrange for, I think in RRBs it may not be there, some e-cubicles, e where electronic cubicles, where you can use their computer and operate in internet banking. Then um, banks are also, um, yeah, this banks, or some banks, they also collect the government deposits, government taxes. Banks are also doing uh, the job of providing lockers to people. Other banks, commercial banks, they issue guarantees, then LCs and all. I think even RRBs will be issuing guarantees, but not LCs. So this is the these are the activities of banks. Mainly, okay. these are the activities of the banks. Very good. Thank you so much. We have done up to 10th question today. I request you all to prepare for that priority sector by tomorrow okay. and come prepared. Okay? Okay. Okay, okay sir. Thank you. Thank you sir. Best wishes. Thank you. Thank you. Good. Today we had a very lengthy discussion. Thank you so much. Best wishes. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Bye. Bye-bye.